See this? This is the house where I was born. We're in Quebec City. We're Keith and Deb. Our goal is to make the most of each day with adventures big and small. This past year, we've been exploring Canada from Vancouver all the way to Quebec City, where we are today. Yes, we came down for the weekend to see my grandmother and to see my family members and to hang out and show Devin uh, what Quebec's all about. Yep, let's do it. And practice for French, of course. J'ai besoin de caffeine maintenant. Oui, super. Bon, on va continuer à pratiquer ensemble. Ok, Devin, tu veux quoi? Qu'est-ce que tu veux? Le caffeine maintenant. <laughs> Café, s'il vous plaît. Avec le lait. <laughs> there you go, so she's working on it. Quebec is home for me. I was born there, sure, I lived there when I was a kid, but mainly because we moved around so much because of my dad's job in the military, we always came back for the holidays to see family. It's one of the few places that was actually consistent in my life. Oh, Oh, it's very strong coffee. Oh, oui? En café fort. It's the same word. Je comprends sept mots. Two things. It is already Christmas here in Quebec. It's very beautiful, even though there's no snow. Second thing, my first attempt à la français was a no. <laughs> she switched to English when I spoke French to her. The yeah. thing with, with Devon is that she understands French. She's, uh, she totally gets it. She hears my family, myself speak with my parents in French all the time, and my sister, and with her fiancé. So you're around French all the time. It's just that we don't practice that much because we're always exposed to people that would respond in English, right? So it's hard to put yourself in a situation where you have to do it. So that's what we're doing this weekend. So I'm trying to make Devon do it and then maybe break the ice so that we can speak together in French more frequently. Oui! Santé. <laughs> if you didn't know, Quebec City is the second oldest city in Canada. After St. John's, Newfoundland. It was founded in 16. 1608. There you go, you got it. Can you say it in French? <laughs> no, numbers I still need to work on. Qu'est-ce que c'est en français, Keith? 1608. For several thousands of years prior to the arrival of Europeans, the site of Quebec City was occupied by indigenous hunters and fishermen. In 1535, Jacques Cartier discovered a fairly large Iroquois village, Stadacona, whose 1,000 or so inhabitants lived from fishing, hunting, and cultivating of corn. A permanent French settlement was established in 1608 when Champlain founded a trading post. We hit the jackpot of beautifulness. We found such a beautiful location. British accent in Quebec. It reminds me of Europe. At it the is. Moment. Look how European this is. So that was a funiculaire. Oui, parfait. Merci beaucoup. Which is pretty much an elevator to get up to the Shadow Front and Neck. If you got the, the monies, I'd recommend doing it. If you're trying to save the monies, like us. This is a must, that must do here in Quebec. We are going to take the stairs. Exercise! <laughs> Woo! Did you get that? Devin just wiped out, sprayed the coffee everywhere. 
Wow. Devin's actually pretty clumsy, if you guys didn't know that. I, I spent a lot of time with her. She's clumsy. I had enough caffeine anyway. She'll have my fine. coffee. There's a bit left. So after all those stairs and a spilled coffee, we made it to the top. <laughs> was it worth it though? It was because I got some exercise. You lost the coffee. <laughs> I did have one sip left because it landed okay, upward. I'm going to take mine back because you're going to spill it. <laughs> Le Chateau Frontenac was built in 1893 as a part of a series of chateau-esque styled hotels built by the Canadian Pacific Railway Company. Roosevelt Churchill and Mackenzie King arranged the invasion of Normandy at Chateau Frontenac. It is often said to be the world's most photographed hotel. It is also a UNESCO World Heritage Site. Devin, okay, what do we do now? Ils font s'en aller. Which means we have to go because we're going Keith's grandma's for dinner. Allez après vous, Keith. <laughs> oh, look how pretty this way here. Let's do it this way, right? Yeah. Let's cross. So we remember where we parked, sort of. So we'll see if we make it to the car. We made it. Back at Raku. Are you tired? No, I feel energized because it's actually only like 4.30. It's just, yeah. what's it called? The hours? Dark? <laughs> no, daily savings hours, which actually doesn't really save daylight because it's getting dark earlier. It saves it in the morning. We woke up at 10.30 this morning, so it did not save <laughs> us any daylight. Yeah. <laughs> We're going, bye, see you there. Hello. On a apporté des clémentines. Oh, nice! Good catch! It was amazing! Yay! <laughs> Come on! Qu'est-ce que c'est ça? Bonjour! Bonjour! <laughs> Qu'est-ce que c'est ça? C'est un robot? Euh... C'est notre caméra. I am Hello! I'm cooking! So we, sh so we shall be eating. Puis vous allez rentrer dans Anne, hey, come back here! Bye! <laughs> Good morning. We're here at my grandmother's house still. It snowed last night, so it looks really good. It's Monday, so Devin's teaching downstairs, and I'm gonna do some trading practice up here. But first, let's make a coffee. How's your teaching day, Dev? It's going very well. Yeah. It's been a good morning. It's been rainy all morning, so I have a little pause en français, or break. <laughs> so we're going for a walk to get outside and get our bodies moving before I have to go back to work. A little walk around the neighborhood. This lake behind us is called the Lac Durand, and it's environmentally protected by the province, which means that you can't have any sort of motorized vehicle on the lake, and you can't have anything within 20 meters or 10 meters of the shore, so no docks and stuff either. Which is really cool, because you can tell the wildlife here is at its Abundant. prime. Just while I was teaching, I got this big window in front of me, and I was just watching all these beautiful birds land and fly. And yeah, it's a beautiful it's spot. It's really nice, yeah. The lake is also part of the fresh water supply for the city of Quebec, which is why they also want to protect it even more. Just the coffee you can go and keep. It's complicated. I'm not my machine, so I have to... I've perfected this machine, but I did not perfect the grinder. Hence, they spilled the beans and took me half an hour to get this. Talk 
talking about beans. Here's one on the floor we didn't pick up. Anyhow, All now right. to the important stuff. The coffee. A solid 20 minutes later. Here's a coffee, Devin. Thank you. Mm. Let's go enjoy some of that sunlight. Hey Dad, what time is it? Ice cream o'clock. <laughs> ice cream o'clock. Quoi, Devin? C'est le temps? Pour la crème glacée avec. Mais il fait froid pas mal. Avec ouais. chocolat. Avec <laughs> crème mère de qui? Oui, il fait froid, hein? Oui, vous êtes certain que vous voulez de la crème glacée? Ben, si on est à son âme, il faut acheter de la crème glacée. Eh oui? Ben oui. <laughs> non? <laughs> pas chaud. It's a bit cold for ice cream, is what uh, she's saying. We made it to one of the best places here in Tottenham to go to. Le Bar Laitier Chocolat Harmonie. So this is the kind of place that serves you soft serve, but dipped in whatever you want. J'aime l'ice cream. No, crème glacée. Attends, on va voir J'aime la crème glacée. Oui, ok. Mm. On... Boom. Check this. Big boy out. Okay, that's totally blocked my face. Yeah, look, they have an ice cream ahead. <laughs> we have to go because we have to drive home before it melts. Mmm. <sighs> it's still really good. Oh my god. We waited a little too long to eat this and the chocolate hardened. So I think that chocolate is? It doesn't sweat, it's like hard. Now, if you eat it right away though, it's like soft chocolate on top. I think we'll be here a while, so we'll see you in a bit. <laughs> All right, Devin, we're heading out. So it's the next day we were in an ice cream coma, but now we are leaving and heading home. This is a lunch bag it's really heavy. full of sandwiches, sandwiches and fruits, because my grandmother is so amazing and so nice. <laughs> We're now leaving. It's really hard to go, honestly, because this place feels like home. I, I haven't been here in a while. See you soon. We will see you soon. Oui, soon. Yes. Yes. Merci encore. T'es tellement formidable. No. Mm. Bye, Grandma. À la prochaine. Thank you. Sorry it's all sunny and stuff, but that's how it is. It's a beautiful day. It Good day for driving. Day. Thank you uh -huh. so much for watching our vlog. I don't want to go home. Hopefully you learned something new about Quebec City. Too. See you next time. Thanks for watching. Merci beaucoup. Merci. Bye. That was the... You have to say it. <laughs> I don't know how to say it. You, you can try. That was the funicular. Funicular. <laughs> now I'm having trouble. Alright, Mr. Filming Pants, let's go.